Hi, this is Wiley Sharp with Denison Yachting, and today I want to do my picks for the month of June for catamarans under $500,000. Number three for the month of June for me under $500,000 is a 2008 Lagoon 440 owner's version asking $379. The boat's located in Fort, Lauder Fort Lauderdale, Florida. It's equipped with a uh, Code Zero, electric winches, generator, air conditioning, water maker, dishwasher, gory folding props, solar, it's got updated Garmin electronics, inverter, and a couple of other nice bits of equipment. Boat was used for uh, cruising with the family and uh, their adventures are done, so she's ready for a new owner. Number two for me for the month of June, Catamarans under 500,000, is a 2013 Valde Peugeot Lapari 41 owner's version. Uh, this boat actually just was repowered with new Volvos as part of that Volvo e um, EPA emissions recall. So there's literally like three hours on the motors and they're under factory warranty. So that's uh, one of the really cool things. They also upgraded it to the 30 horsepower uh, Volvos. Boats go to a generator, air conditioning, inverter, LED lighting, uh, upgraded Garmin electronics, electric winch, uh, square top main, water maker, all in all a really nice boat for uh, cruising. And then number one for me for the month of June, catamarans under $500,000 is a 2008 Leopard 40 owner's version in Aruba asking $265,000. Uh, you know, I've, I've sold a lot of these Leopard 40s over the years, <coughs> excuse me, and um, I just think they make a really, really good uh, cruising boat kind of in that 40 foot range. Part of why I selected this is the uh, boat of the month under $500,000. Uh, this particular boat's got under 1,000 hours on the Yanmar diesels. They're also the upgraded 30 horsepower Yanmar diesels. And then the sellers have put a lot of uh, equipment into the boat over the last few years. So it's got a, a new water maker. They've added a bow sprint with a, a Code Zero, a new running rigging, updated uh, Garmin Electronics, generator, air conditioning, LED lighting, inverter, and you know a couple other things you'll need for cruising like spares and other, something, other things like that. So if you have any questions on these three boats, please leave a comment down below, shoot me an email, and as always, if you like what I have to say, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thanks and have a good day.